All right, so we have our VR cable system. Simply open up the box. Here we've got our cables. We've got some bands with small Allen wrenches here. And our sticky hooks with the screw hooks. And last, our instruction manual, easy to read, easy to follow. Take a look here, you can see in the little loop, it's a little bit tight, there's not a lot of space, it's quite small. Still I can stretch it. But if I wanted to extend that, I simply can take my Allen wrench. I have two, two Allen wrenches. Put it on the inside and turn it counterclockwise to the left. Open it up a little bit and you can see this one. I can take the wire and now I can pull this wire and extend it. In fact, I could take it out if I wanted to. Put it back in just a little bit. Hold it with my fingers. Take my Allen wrench. Turn it to the right. Get it just a little bit tight, not too much. It's a little bit tight. Pull out the Allen wrench. It doesn't get stuck in there. And now you can see I've got a lot more space still very sturdy a lot more space here if I need to and a very simple way to adjust this part of the wire so again if I needed to adjust though I can stretch it I take my Allen wrench Grab the cord, turn it to the left, and now I will go ahead and tighten this this way. I'm going to take a little bit more wire, just pull it in, make it tight how I want. Take my Allen wrench and turn it to the right. Bend it up just a little bit. And you can see now here I've got a little bit of leeway if I wanted to for something later. But again, I can extend. It's very sturdy. And that is a simple way to change the length if I need to with these small Allen wrenches. Alright, so I'm going to take the wire here. My plastic band, I will wrap it under the vibe wire, loop it around. As you can see, I've got the hook. It's quite strong. You'll need to press down on it and pretty simple. Hook it right through and you can see now I've got a sturdy connection with this wire and repeat the process. Okay, now we're going to make it very tight around the wire. Simply connect it. This time we will pull it through. This way it is very tight. It's not going to move much left or right. Take my clip, press down, connect it through. And here you can see that it doesn't move left or right. Alright, so right here I've got my instruction manual on the front. Turn it around and it opens just like a book. Open it to the left. Here you can see the plane area on the right hand side, which would be your left. And the instructions number one and number two. Number one has a 
plastic piece here with the hook. Set it back, make it easier next time I can pull it off. It is very sticky, very strong. So make sure you do not remove the film until you are ready to put it against the wall or your sliding glass door or perhaps your glass window. When you're ready to put your sticky film on the ceiling, make sure you have a tall ladder and somebody is holding your ladder for safety. I want to make sure when I pull the plastic film off like so. Now I've removed it completely. It's important that I paste it as soon as possible onto the ceiling and I will hold it for approximately five seconds. Find where I want it. It looks pretty good here. Lay it from the back to the front. Make sure there's no bubbles. Use your fingers and one, two, three, four, five. You can take your fingers, press it around, make sure that there's no bubbles here. I'll come on this side, make sure there's no bubbles, press it out, and we are good. When I'm ready to play, take my ladder safely, make sure I have a friend, somebody, when I'm coming up here this high on the ceiling, for safety, hook, and we are done. Very easy. Pull it here. I want to hook it around just like I had showed earlier on the table. I can take the plastic. It's very strong. This rubber. Loop it around, and I will press quite hard on the clasp because it's a very good clasp. It's strong. You press hard, and it is secure. You can see it is secure here and it is finished. Repeat the process. I will do it one more time. Take my wire. Doesn't matter if it's forward or back. Simply open it. Turn. It's twisted a little bit. That's no problem. I will press down and there you go. It is secure and steady. So safety is very important. Earlier we talked about the space for calibrating up in front, behind, make sure I have plenty of space. Lastly, before I play, safety of my equipment. I want to make sure that I take care of my equipment. I've got the wristband here. I simply can just loop it through. It's good. If anything happens, no problem. If it drops, it's not going to break. And again, we want to be very careful and make sure that we're protecting our equipment so we can use it, have fun for a very long time, for a very long time. So, now that I'm ready to go, I'll put the headset on and let's go have some fun.